Ah, oh, David. So, uh, how are you enjoying Messiah 2023? Hi, John. It's been a fantastic conference. Uh, so much going on here all, all during the day and then the evening worship services and then the wonderful uh, speakers. The highlight for me probably has been the afternoon yeshivas, the, the special uh, higher education classes. They did the first half of the week we had a special class on biblical archaeology uh, by an actual uh, uh, expert archaeologist who also is a, a professor who teaches it as well, as well as it does it out in the field. And we went through all sorts of archaeological evidence uh, from, uh, from, from Noah, uh, his ark, to, to, to Moses and the Exodus, uh, the Jericho, and, and, and all uh, Israeli history. It was an amazing course on, on, on proving the facts of the Bible from objective uh, evidence through archaeology. And then the second half of the week was a course on, on uh, biblical apologetics, uh, uh, proving the resurrection. Uh, and and, 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 and uh, interacting with skeptics uh, and, and atheists like, like Bart, uh, Bart Erdman, a famous atheist who, who reject the resurrection, and, and uh, interacting with, with their arguments uh, and, and showing proofs through the scriptures, through extra biblical evidence, uh, through uh, Paul's writings, only using those writings that the skeptics themselves recognize as being authentic parts of the New Testament, which is only about seven or eight of the letters. Uh, and just from those alone, Proving uh, the, the, the life and the death and the burial and the resurrection uh, of Yeshua and all the, the, uh, the testimony uh, and the eyewitness accounts uh, and all the various uh, surrounding circumstances uh, to be able to uh, give it a defense of your faith uh, and respond to uh, skeptical and critical arguments uh, for, and uh, to establish the resurrection. Well, that sounds great. I know that we have had a very excellent week and we use this time as a season to get recharged in our faith and to interact with other people across the Messianic community. And we're looking forward to seeing what God's going to do the second half of this year back in Texas. Amen.